Hello everyone, I'm Chuck Johnson, a Power Platform developer at Artis. Today I'm going to talk through a reusable query you can use to add to your models, which gives you date and time of your most recent refresh. A lot of times uh, your clients or end users will want this displayed in the report, so they will always know when their imported data has last been refreshed. But let's get right into the solution, a blank PBIX, and we'll start with just one snippet of code, a simple date time function. Uh, also, I'll be sharing uh, the simple Power Query advanced editor code and measures so you can reuse this for your reports. Here's that blank PBIX, and we'll start by creating a blank query. All right, we'll paste in that little piece of code. And we'll convert that to a table. And we can rename our query. Last refresh. And we'll give our column a title. And then if we add column, we can duplicate this. We're going to get two, two fields, both one with date time and one with date. So if we come over here, this one can just be our date. And then we'll format them. This will be date date time. All right, that's all we have to do in Power Query. Um, let's apply this, load it down to the model. While I have this open, I can copy off our advanced editor code. And we'll use that. If we want to come in here, we could just insert a text box and then kind of drop that in that way. You could uh, copy this off to another report very quickly. OK, we're going to create a couple measures now, one for date, one for date time, simple measures that just uh, calculate the value of that uh, field. A new measure. Drop it in there. Notice the format comes out with a time attached. We'll just pick our favorite date only format. And if we put that in a card, we'll see that we have that there. And we'll make one more measure for date time. Format on that is fine. We'll drop another card in for date time. All right. Um, if you do want to copy this off, you can either use this advanced editor uh, code you have here, or of course, if you came in here, you can copy off a whole query by right click and copy, and then come into a new, a new PBIX, go into your Power Query. And you could paste it right in that way as well. You could do that with multiple queries if you want to, um, you know, grab a few different queries and paste them into a new PBIX. If you enjoyed this video, please like and share. Also, please subscribe to Artist Consulting YouTube channel. We have a lot of great content from our team. Thank you everyone for watching. Stay tuned for our next video.